This truck doesn't have nearly enough stickers. Hey, I'm Ben. I'm a huge fly fisherman. Hi, welcome back to another episode of Huge Fly Fisherman. I'm pretty stoked you're here. Today we're gonna talk about what's in my truck. I totally stole this idea from Gareth at Trout Hunting NZ and probably a bunch of other people too. So now it's my turn. Now before you say anything, I know this is not a truck. It's just a better video title than what's in my car. I don't care what you call it because I'm not one of those guys that feels like he isn't a man unless he has a truck. This is a forerunner because Toyotas and Subarus are mandatory for all huge fly fishermen. You knew that, right? All right, well, what's in my truck? We'll start in the front and work our way back. This is my stereo. It plays mostly Reggie music. My stereo has party mode. Because I like to party, mostly with Reggie music. I'm on a road trip, so it might be a little messy in here. It's definitely dusty. Here's a mask because, well, you know. But I usually wear my buff instead, so everyone will know I'm a huge fly fisherman. They're not dorky! Okay, what's next? Oh, here's the glove box. Mostly it's just for stickers. Oh, it's this. Some random carp flies. There's some dirt and boogers down here on the floor. Here's where I charge my phone so I can take pics for the gram. Got a couple extra pairs of sunglasses. Notice I have seat covers. Those are pretty sweet. Center console. No, that's private. I'm not showing you that. That's where I keep my egg flies. I think that does it for the front. Let's move back. The middle seat's laid down right now. There's usually car seats for the kids back there. Right now, it's just a bunch of tools in case I need to patch my waders. Gotta be prepared. I got a roof box for dirty or bulky items. Or if your buddy's a Tenkara fisherman, he can ride up there. Let's move to the back. I have a pro staff sticker because, well, you know, got one of my stickers. You can buy them at hugeflyfisherman.com along with hats and stuff. There's the trailer hitch, watch out for that. Here's a rod rack thing to hold my fish poles. If you don't know why I don't have one of those nifty rod vaults for my truck, you need to watch more of my videos. You can start with this one right here. All right, what else we got? My fishing backpack. Maybe you've seen the video I did. I've got all the usual stuff in there, but I've added some bug juice. It mixes real nice on your skin with the sunscreen. I've got my wet wading gear. Maybe you've seen that video I did. I've got a drone because I'm a huge dork. <laughs> Check this out. You know what this is? This is a piece of an umbrella rig that we pulled out of a pelican. His name is Norman. Couple random flies here. There's a big cooler because I'm camping. Let's get that out of there. You know what? It's too heavy. I'm going to leave it. You think 40 pounds of ice is enough? Here is a smaller day cooler for beverages. I like beverages. Here's my lucky hat. Maybe you saw that video that I did. What's this? <sighs> this is a wading belt. Bill, I think this is yours. Oh, this cooler's a beast. What do we have over here? Some muck boots, just in case I run into some muck. Some work gloves, in case I run into some work. Got a first aid kit. Got a spare rain jacket. What's this? Uh-oh, a Panther Martin. It's for my kids, I swear. And I think we've covered it all. There's nothing left. So you know what that means? It's time to go fishing. Oh wait, I gotta crack a beer first. Luckily, I've got a handy day cooler for beverages. So that's it. Thanks for coming along with me and checking out my truck or whatever you want to call it. If you see me out and about, say hi and I'll slap a sticker on your face. Thanks for watching another huge fly fisherman video. I'll see you next Monday with another brand new video. I'm going to go fishing and maybe catch something now. Stay huge. Now, if you were part of the team, you could have jumped right there. <laughs>